G'day everybody, Ozzy Nuts here. Welcome to another Fallout 76 quick guide. I'm hopefully going to enlighten you on something that I didn't know, and I've been playing this game for quite some time, but I had no idea that you can actually go and get certain items that are either no longer on the Atomic Store, or they uh, only come around on a holiday rotation. So hopefully this video will help you get some of the items that you've been missing or longing for, like it did with me. So this is pretty, pretty straightforward. Um, what you have to do is you'll be going to the Bethesda website on screen right now. You should see the link there and it will pop up down below in the description as well. And once there, this is what you'll see. So you make sure you logged in or you can log in after the fact. So once you get here, you're going to go to Fallout 76. Now, keep in mind, this could take anywhere from five days to three weeks, I've heard. Uh, the ones that uh, we've done uh, took around five days to basically go from where, we're, where we are now to having the item in your inventory. So, then you want to go to billing purchase code. Once that comes up, you're going to select your platform. Make sure you choose the right platform. And then you're going to choose, I need help with the atomic shop right here. And then from there, you're going to say, yeah, absolutely. I want that item. And then once you're logged in, it'll probably ask you at this point to log in, I think from memory, but since I'm already logged in, I've already gone past that part. Um, you know, you want to choose, I want to purchase an atomic shop item for myself. Now, if you want to gift it to somebody else that you'll choose this option here, but if you want to choose it for yourself, this is where you'll go. And then you'll confirm your platform. Um, obviously it's going to be for me steam, even though it's asked before you enter your steam ID right here. And let me show you how to get your like steam ID is probably the one thing that people are not too sure on. So. Let me quickly show you how to get there. So you're going to go to your Steam profile up top. You're going to choose account details. And up here is your Steam ID. That's one way to do it. There are, there are actual websites out there that can uh, let you know your Steam ID as well. But you're going to simply right click and copy that. And then go back to the web page. You'll put your Steam ID in there or your Xbox gamer tag, your net, you know, PlayStation network ID, whatever. Stadia, I don't think that's around anymore, but yeah. And here is a full list of items that you can get. So, I mean, there, there is a lot. There is a website that I'll put up on screen as well uh, momentarily that can actually has this, but it doesn't have pictures. So if I was you, make sure that if you're going to choose something, make sure you Google it first, go to images, check out somebody else's, um, you know, video just to see how it looks. Is it what you really want? You can choose bundles and you can have up to two items. So here's the other items, which is the same list, except for you can choose two, which would be nice if you could have more than that. But um, you know, you just say you're going to choose, you want the communist handmade gun skin or the communist fence, the coming to town bundle. You're going to hit submit. And this is where your ticket ID will be. You'll click view ticket. And this is where it'll tell you. Thanks for confirming. Here is basically how much atoms we will take out of your account. So make sure you have these atoms in your account. You've got to have them in your account. Otherwise it will not happen. And all you have to do is reply back to the message. Uh, yes, please. I confirm, uh, you can take out, uh, 2,800 atoms from my account. Something like that. You just, you just want to confirm to them that you're okay with them doing it. And then you'll just click update there. And basically what that'll do is it's in their hands. You've confirmed. Yes, it's okay. You can take this out and this is what I'm going to get in return. So it's pretty straightforward. Um, and if you accidentally made it, just click marks as, marked as solved. Um, if not, um, click update. That'll be then, you know, that'll 
confirm to them that you're wanting them to take it out. Give me a sec. I'm just waiting for it to load. There you go. Done. So now when Bethesda sees this, they'll say, okay, taking out the 2800, they're going to get this in return. It can take up to three weeks, I heard. So keep that, keep that in mind. All right, guys. Hopefully it's helped. There's a big list right here. You can just copy and paste it from here instead of seeing the little drop down where you can't see many. And I'll put this link up there as well. There is a lot. I mean, there is a lot. Haunted house camp bundle, like bundles themselves. You can even get um, certain, uh, I think there was a Brotherhood of Steel DLC in here as well that I was missing at one point and I was able to get it from there. Yeah, there you go. So anyway, guys, please let me know if this has helped. Hopefully it's been a straightforward video. Make sure you confirm after the ticket's gone through, reply back. Yes, I'm okay with you taking that out of my account. And then just wait for the items to come in. All right, guys, have a good one. Hope to see you soon. Add Aussie Nuts on PC if you want to hang out and uh, chinwag. And I'll see you soon. Have a good one.